Hey you guys and welcome to my first vlog tutorial and today we will be working on my little boy. But first I know you guys are probably thinking what the heck is a vlog tutorial? Well it's like a vlog and I'm doing the tutorial as well, hence vlog tutorial. You know, there's something I kind of made up. I don't even know if I made this up, I don't even know if this is a thing but we're going to do it today. But today we are going to add some color, lock extensions, my little boy is about to go through a full transformation. And I decided to do it vlog style so you could see what I really got to deal with when I am doing my little boy's hair. Like, listen, if you have boys, then you know. So we're going to start off with bleaching. I've been my handy dandy BW2 powder and my lowest developer 20 or 10 will be perfect. I only got 20, so we're going to use that. And we're going to mix it up because that is what we're going to be using to bleach my son's hair. Now I will recommend doing a strand test before bleaching your hair or anybody else's hair just to make sure that your hair takes the color. Now that we have whipped up our concoction, we're going to need some professional foils because you know I'm very professional. I got the best foils on the market, okay? High quality stuff buff right here this is the best foil to use on your hair and I forgot to mention we're only coloring two locks today only two so let's talk about lock extensions this is my son's natural lock as you can see we're still going through some budding compared to the lock extension you can see a huge difference the extension is slightly darker and slightly bigger than my son's natural locks but not to worry not to worry because we're going to fix that i got my lock extensions from the lock editions here on instagram and just to show you an example i've already installed and styled and trim and shaped these locks and you can see they look nice they really did turned out very nice but you should be prepared to do some type of maintenance or tweaking when it comes to someone else making your lock extensions you know just keep that in mind so you guys make sure you check her out she's a small black owned business i will have all her social media handles and contact information listed below if you guys are interested in checking her out this video is not sponsored i'm strictly doing it off the strength i'm just using my little tiny platform to help other black girls get on okay we about to take over this so if you guys want to see a full tutorial on how i did this to this please give this video a thumbs up once this video hits 500 likes then i'm gonna go ahead and upload the other one you know you help me I help you. You know how this go, okay? But we're gonna jump into baby boy. Yes, we're about to install these lock extensions. See, I'm gonna show you what happens when you wait until your hair is at least two to three inches. Trust me, it make a hell of a difference. But I'm going to demonstrate another popular way to installing your lock extensions. So you saw that I had my son's hair and I separated and placed the lock extension in between those pieces. Then I just took the loose hair of that extension wrapped it around the back, brought it over, and braided it down. So that may have been a little too fast, so we're gonna slow it down a little bit. You wanna separate it into twos. Then I'm gonna take the lock extension, place it in between those two pieces. Boom, look, they're hugging, boom, boom, boom. Then that loose hair, I'm gonna bring it around back. Well, then we're gonna come through the front. Boom, we're gonna come right out through the front door. And if you know how to braid, then you should be able to braid it down. Once you braid all you can braid and you cannot grip anymore, you want to begin wrapping the loose hair around that lock extension and just wrap it all the way around until there's no hair left. <laughs> And as always, you want to take your single headed crochet needle. You want to begin to insta lock the hair just a little bit. You want to make sure that extension is nice and secure. So you just want to jab it a few times and then boom, you got a nice sturdy permanent lock extension. And I'm going to go ahead and address the elephant in the room because I know somebody is going to have something to say. Yes, my room is a mess. No, I do not care what your room looks like. Mind your business. We in the process of getting it together. Just let us do us, okay? Dang. All right, so now that we got that out the way, we're going to finish jabbing this lock extension and add that little extra one. And yeah, that's pretty much it for this, this part. Yeah, yeah. But that's the story on how I install my son's lock extensions. Pretty simple to the point. Like I said, definitely check out lock extensions. You will not be disappointed. But now it's time to add some color. 
my son is a marvel fanatic he loves marvel and with the unfortunate passing of black panther we decided to do marvel inspired locks i am not one of those parents who have told their child that their favorite superhero has passed away and i plan to keep it that way so don't become a victim by telling my son because then you have to deal with me but anywho one lock will be hulk inspired obviously and as you can see i'm using a semi-permanent green color you remember last time i tried to make my own green and it didn't really turn out that that great but this time i use it in spark color green and that thing that thing clean that thing clean right there of course i'll have all these colors listed below if you're interested but can you guess his second favorite superhero and i sort of got y'all say captain america if you say anything with america in it that is a no it's a no for me dog but we are doing spider-man does whatever a spider -Man. i don't even know the song but um yeah we're doing spider-man yeah <laughs> applying the color of course you're gonna let it sit for about 30 minutes rinse it out and boom you should have this banging color right here the color turned out amazing I absolutely love it I am very happy but we're gonna move on and start retwisting his hair I'll be using the super grow to retwist and style my son's locks it's been four months I think since his last retwist so we need to get this together <laughs> I finished retwisting. Now I'm going to set it with Dr. Locke's Imani Lock and Spray to add an extra hold. And really quickly, I want to show you the final result for Lock Editions Lock Extensions. Voila! Look how great they look. They look just like my son's natural locks. They are slightly darker than his natural hair color, but that's fine. You really can't tell the difference, but I am a happy camper. But now we're going to move on to styling. So I repeated a hairstyle. If you're interested in an in-depth tutorial on this style of course i will have it listed below for you all but as of right now we're going to run through it again if you want an in-depth tutorial i'll have it listed below <laughs> So I've completed styling his hair and now we're going to add a little bit of oil. I have the Supergirl oil and I'm going to use a little bit of that to add a little bit of shine, a little nutrient, a little moisture back to my son's scalp. And I'm going to struggle why I do that because I didn't poke a big enough hole into this. So yeah, we're just going to rub that into the scalp, make sure it's really in there. And then we're going to grab this Nairobi setting mousse and I'm going to use this to help set my son's hair. I used to love using this when I had natural hair for my perm rod says oh used to come out so bomb but now i'm just going to use this to add a little extra hole i'm going to allow him to air dry because sending him under the dryer for another five minutes is no good as you can see he would prefer to air dry because he would yeah yeah this is my little monster but yes i hope you guys did like this tutorial the lock extensions the color everything turned out great i am pretty happy i'm pretty happy don't forget to like if you guys would like to see another lock extension tutorial but until next time until we meet again until we're back on youtube watch another crazy video of mine bye bye